You've made a wise decision, gentlemen. Be it poison of the soul or the soil, trust that Palakana's fires will purify. Let it cleanse your sins and your refuse. You are all now members of my family. In due time, the leaders of your country will unveil a new energy initiative. Finally, your great nuclear reactors will come to life again, enriching us all. Truly, those fortunate enough to be gathered here will be made prosperous, will be made fat with wealth. We are in your debt, my generous sage. On behalf of all citizens of Japan, thank you for cleansing our nation. I've spoken to the minister. We're clear to begin reopening the power plants. My humblest gratitude. If I may be so bold, you are a ray of silver light that has shone upon our burdened economy. In so many words, a savior. Let us not forget our silent partner, Ebina-san. We owe this day to you as well. You deserve far more glory than we can offer. Indeed. You've done a great deal for us, Ebina-san. You honor me, Chairman. Once my organization is restructured, I look forward to sharing the public eye with you. Till then, I graciously accept your guidance, now and in the future. Apologies, gentlemen. I fear our time is up. I'm overdue for a ritual with my flock. Farewell. Good news, Overseer. What is it? We secured the girl. She's coming in on the next boat. And am I supposed to be impressed by this? Uh... Had you settled this earlier, I wouldn't have relied on Ebina's help. If ever there comes a day when he uses this against us, it'll be your last, Dwight. There won't, I swear. You have all been chosen. Father Bryce has granted you the right of fire. Now, forsake yourself to the flames and save these lowly sinners. Keep going. Their impurities have not been fully purged. They are to be unspoiled, nothing less. You have made me very proud, my children of Palikana. Even if the world were to collapse into darkness, I'm confident your flames would light the way. Still awake? You're no good to her exhausted, you know. <laughs> Lonnie! I'm so sorry, Akane-san. It's all my fault. <sighs> Fucking hell. What a sorry sight. He's gonna bash him in the head with the crowbar and knock him out his knee. Hey, 
Oh, never mind. Oh. Ah! Yeah, I called it, kind of. I don't particularly give a shit if you run up. I love this man. The clock falling like a child. But remember one thing. Kazuma Kiryu's still out there. And you've let that man down too many times already. He saw something in you. Somehow. <gasps> now get up. You're right. It's time to go. Start moving then. You've wasted enough time. Yeah. Ooh, I'm back with... Ooh. Yay. Oh, I'm back. Oh, I only got these three. Okay. Nothing wrong with that. Join my team, please. You're my. Oh, jeez. I'm getting a lot of things right now. I'm gonna have to wait a second. These are all popping. Oh, I think we're good. Give me a second. Let me uh, see my gear. I'm gonna equip in you. And then we're good there. Actually, there we go. What did you have again? You had. Um... Man, it's still going. Champion's Ring, why not? We are gonna power you up. And then everyone else is... Oh, she's not here. Holy cow. How many things did I unlock? I'm just gonna talk. Oh, it's you. Hey, thank you for taking care of Kiri san By the way. Thank our patriarch. I did... I just did as I was told. Um, it might be rude to ask, but... How do you end up here? My story's the same as all the others. We were in a bad situation, needed rescue. Hmm? Rescue? Different reasons for different folk, but one way or another, we lost our place back home. Like many, I drifted for some time, then ended up here. He took us in without question, gave us a new home. Is that true, Yamai killed a man back in Japan? It is. He was drifting too when he first arrived, but somehow he carved out his own land in Honolulu. Through sheer strength of will, smack dab in the middle of Mafia stronghold. The whispers around his story gave us something to believe in. And so, the Amai Syndicate was born. <sighs> hmm. I'd wonder why you didn't call yourselves the Amai family. Where'd Syndicate come from? Well, strictly speaking, we were never Yakuza. Yeah. What? Hold on, I thought... Tomizawa, Tomizawa, was it? Tell me, did Amai ever have you swear an oath? No. I guess not. <laughs> the old guard calls him mate patriarch and keeps up the act. Understandable, the yeah, understandable that the new members might make assumptions. That's not to say we consider ourselves upstatic citizens, of course. Words aside, we know we're involved in. We know we're part of an ugly legacy. Oh, yeah. Your mind never liked the patriarch title. However, I think he's grown tired of fighting it. I'm starting to see why his people are so loyal. Thank you. Thanks for the chat, old man. Hmm. Man my age sees any opportunity to ramble on. Alright. Hey, Miss Hot. What do you want? You gave our boss a lot of grief. You won't see any hospitality from me. Sure, I get it. You're my. You must find him pretty charming, huh? Hmm. What would you know about it? Nah, just to each their own. Think wherever you want. That man gave us a home. Now leave. You're a welcome guest. Alright, Tommy. Why found a Kane, San and Lani? I thought we were finally good. And they took it all away from us. I can't stop thinking about Hanawasan and Wong. Shit. This whole time, we've been playing right in the bad guy's hand. Yeah, I know. That really sucks. Hey. I know we've been buried deep in shit before, Kazuga, but... This time... Feels like the deepest. No. Maybe, but there's no use wallowing in it. We still have to go after Lani. We gotta move while she's might she might still be alive. Yeah. But where do we even start looking? 
Mm. We haven't got a clue. Fucking cl oh, sorry. We haven't got a clue. Fucking one right now. We haven't got. We haven't got clue. Fucking one right now. Oh, oh clue number one. Uh, okay. And you're my. Ah. Yeah, peep. I got people tracking the barracudas in the ganja. If we're lucky, someone might cough up some info on the girl. Hey, Adachi-san. Is Chichan around? Hmm? She was here a while ago. Shit. You don't think. Could she have bailed on us? Seriously? Why would she do that now? This whole time, Age has been using her to play us like suckers. Maybe she figured, now that the truth's out, we'd take revenge. But chi -chan tried to warn us, didn't she? When Polycana was on their way, she came clean. She has to know she's still one of us. Well, think of it this way. If chi -chan had given Eiji up just a few minutes earlier, Lonnie might still be here. Anawa-san and Wong might still be alive. <sighs> Hate to say, but he is true. She waited until the exact last moment. I'm sorry, Kasuga, but Tomi's got a point there. Ah, you too, Adachi san. She must have had a good reason. Chichon wouldn't cut and run. I'm sure she's still around here somewhere. Chichan? Damn it, there's no answer. Chitose, her name was? I just got a report in. She took off on her own a while ago. Chichan? Matter of fact, she swiped one of our pistols on the way out. Ooh, she's about to. I think she's out to kill Eri Chan. Huh? That takes skill. My men know how to keep them under lock and key. Yamai, when did Chichan leave? Do you know? Clocked the piece missing just now. Girl must have left half an hour ago at least. But what would she want a gun for? Would she be going after Lonnie on her own? <sighs> no way in hell. That's not what my gut's saying. But she's going after them. AG and Palakana. She must know where they are. We can't let her! Chichon will get herself killed! Let's move. Now! Hey, hey, hey wait! Hold on a minute! Chichan may know where she's going, but we don't. Oh, you my stop teasing me. Join. You're so cruel. Nice. Before we act rashly, we need a plan, right? Okay, then. I say we talk to the tattoo lady again. Kiyo-san, huh? Oh, Kiyo-san. Uh-huh. Huh? Yeah. If anyone else knows where Chi-Chan's heading, it's her. <laughs> That's not much of a plan, but it'll have to do. Let's go. Yeah, I'm not shocked she left the party. Woo -woo! Great trains coming through! Oh, well, someone's happy. Let's see what we got going on right now. Not much. Oh, there is a thing here. Oh... Adachi links just popped up. Ah, oh, God, now do that one. Let's talk to the tattoo lady and yeah. Also, I know I still have to do the dungeon. I will do it. What? Got something to say? No. Yes, me. Eyes over here. Let's do it. Information now. Oh boy. Looks like I'm up. You guys are crazy. Don't get caught. here. I come. Let's get it done. Open one. Here, man. This ain't moonshine, fella. Burn. I'm up. Ah. 
Register 200 Sujimon to the Suji Dex. Sujimon Sensei. Who knew I had it in me? Cool. I might be a natural. So I officially have 200 Sujimon. I still have to actually start doing Sujimon things. Only got one badge. Hmm. Well, I think there's a decent spot to stop in the story. I'm gonna go to Don't Doki you Island. Even dare. Uh, aloha again, Auntie. Lonnie's been kidnapped. Akane-san could have been killed? Guess word travels fast, huh? <sighs> what a fool I was, trusting a bunch of blundering punks. I leave them in your care and it all goes to pot? Lord, help me! Uh, come on, it's not like that. Uh, wait, let us try to make things right. Chitose, do you remember her? Has she been by here? Why? She finally get fed up with you, dimwits? <sighs> Actually, I think I did see her go by a little while ago. Please say you know where she was headed. What? Do I look like a mind reader? I've no clue, and plenty of times passed since. Uh, yeah, I get it. Chitose's going after A.G. Not much we can be sure of, either for payback or to rescue Lani. Either way, wherever he is, she'll be. I'm guessing Barracuda. That means for us. It means if we find Eiji, we're bound to run into Chitose too. No oh, shit. Well, we don't have any leads on him either. Well, it's still another way to go. It's something. What do you think, Kasuga? The Daidoji safe house, maybe? Eichan. He was there the whole time. Keeping tabs on our every move. Maybe he left something we could use. His lap. Oh. Stands to reason. All right, let's give it a shot. The only thing, Lisa are probably still working the scene. We'll just you know, keep our distance. Yeah. His phone or laptop might still be there. I'll, I'll be the one to say it. Chichan made this group feel a lot less skeezy. Am I wrong here? You're not, no, but uh, it's worse when you call attention to it. Hmm, hmm. We should head to the Daijoji's, Daijoji, Daijoji safe house. Aloha! No, no. Oh. 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 I finally got upgrades for armor. Okay. Ooh, there's a raid that's active up ahead. Do I have that Sujimon? Ah, eh, two fat sos. Gluttonous thugs. I do not have you. Okay. Rest in peace. The battle is on. All right. Got you now. I don't have you, so I'm gonna get you. There you go. Token of friendship. How about it? Huh. 
What's it? It's the right call. <laughs> All right. You count on me. Yay. Hunger Strike, a surprisingly heavy blow delivered with display food and scorching bread. Okay. Sujima, gotta oh, catch him now. Alright, now I have that done, we're gonna go back to the warehouse. Safe house, not warehouse. And then when I think it's a good thing to stop, I'm gonna go to Doki all day. I'm also gonna Sujimon. Oh. Yeah, but please, sorry. We were it. right to bolt from here when we did. The police sure moved fast on this one. Yeah, I'd say they've already carried out the bodies. Either way, we're not getting any closer. Ichiban, if they catch wind of you, it's over. You know, passport, and now no Kiryu-san or Daidoji faction to back you? Really? Are you quite sure of that? <gasps> you guys! Whoa, whoa, who's this? Huh? You know him? Perhaps you don't remember us. We served Hanawise as elite aides. During the attack, we were procuring Akane-san's plane. We had no idea what was coming. We're aware of what happened thanks to the safe house's surveillance camera. Eiji Mitomura was a Polykana operative, it seems. Uh, this seems so. Um, about Hanawa-san and everything. You needn't say anything. His death wasn't your fault, Kasuka-san. Mitamura played his hand well and outwitted us all. We knew that Hawaii would be unfamiliar territory, yet we came short-staffed. Our focus on Polykana left us vulnerable to certain flanks. This was a miscalculation on the part of our superiors. We'll report it as such. Well, jeez. We are fully aware that, if not for you, Akane-san would still be missing or dead. Hanawa died believing in our organization and this mission. If you say so. But it's not that easy for me to believe I wasn't partly responsible. Hope you get that. That's why I'm still involved here. Believe me, we know your psych profile. We'd like to offer you our assistance. What's that mean? Let's find a better place to speak. A.G. Mitamura is in our sights now. We've much more intelligence than before. I'd like to share our findings with your party. It should prove useful. Well, what do you have in mind? Perhaps Kiryu-san's old hotel room would serve? I trust you remember it. Our group will head there first. We shouldn't be seen traveling together. They're pretty polite for a bunch of lizard people. Hanawa must have raised them right. Okay, we should go. Mm-hmm. It makes sense they're alive, because if you watch the cutscene, those three are missing because they're securing the plane for her. So, yeah, that makes sense. Also, yeah, when the day comes, I hope you're all ready to watch me do Sujiman and Doki Island. So it's gonna be nothing but that for a while when I get there. Hi. Oh, bronze train. Have I beat you before? Mm. I might lose this battle if I do so. Ah, oh, let's do it. If I lose, I lose. Let's give it everything we got! Are you ready to do some damage? Time for a Sujimon battle! Alright, let's do this! Ooh, they're fast. You're gonna love this. Fight! This'll put you down. You're finished! Time to shake things up! Any last words? Nice pizza! I have to 
think carefully. There. Come on, come on. That's it. Hell yeah, just like we trained for. I practiced this one. Ooh. Not the damage you. Oh, wow. I'm gonna crush you. I hate to say, man, that tickles. You know what? Let's. Let's change to my. Wait, what rank? You're. Uh, ooh, yes, I actually. You. Knuckle sandwich, actually. Yeah. Knuckle. Yeah. Well done, yeah. everybody. <laughs> Yay. We did it! You guys are the best! Let's wrap up this victory and smile! Oh, who's that Sujima? It's Bummer Stummer Strummer. Rumper Strummer. I keep doing that every time. Can't help it. I didn't put my all in that battle. Next time. Woohoo! Great trains coming through. Come on, come on. I'm on this way, don't look at me. Alright, that's a nice Sujimon battle. Been a while since I've done one of those. See, the problem is I want to ride the street, the street surfer, but then there's just so many items to pick up. I just can't help it. And while we're here, we might as well get. Oh. Hello. How's it Hi, Edward. Bye, Edward. Surfing. One fad that always seems to come and go, just like the waves. Why have you ever gone surfing, Adachi san Sure have. Did my damn best, too. All to woo a woman at the beach. Reality wasn't kind, though. That summer fling was over before it started. <laughs> she burst my hopes and dreams like mere ocean bubbles. What's up with you? Forcing yourself to be a poet or something? I mean, I even tried talking to her like this. Just kept waxing poetic. Well, it's a shame it didn't work out. Ever thought that was why? We're really opening <laughs> up. It used to serve. Aloha! Oh, okay. I don't have a cloud board or this board, which... I'm gonna buy these, because I already have you, yeah. I'm gonna buy you. I'm gonna buy you. Thank you! If you wonder why I'm buying them, it's for crafting. Passion fruit. Oh, there's no magazines. Oh, damn. All right, let's see what the Dodoji faction wants to do. And what information they have. Oh, I have a lot of safe keys. I don't need any more game. You'd be shocked? No, when you do a dungeon, you get like 50 safe keys. We've been waiting for you. Come in. Sorry, has Sujimon Bell on the way. I'm curious. When Kiryu-san got here, were you the ones who booked the room? Yes, we arranged it. We were aware of Kiryu-san's condition, but once again underestimated the dangers he would face. Initially, Akane-san's procurement was our sole and simple objective. Yeah, but in that case, your mission would be accomplished by now. Akane-san's at Yamai's place as we speak. You could just grab her. Indeed. Why don't you have a seat? This may take some time to explain. To put it briefly, Daidoji's plans now extend beyond Akane-san herself. Polykana's actions have illuminated certain aspects of the mission which were otherwise obscured. That is, Akane-san's charge, the girl Lani, is Polykana's true target. So Daidoji faction, Yamai's gang, it's all the same story. Excuse me? Yamai was chasing Akane-san without any idea why, just like you. 
All over Hawaii, people were hunting Akane-san just because they knew someone else was too. Everyone, desperate for a little more pull underground or a one-up on their enemies. I understand. From your perspective, we may seem all too similar. Except, we have always known why Akane-san was sought after by Palekana. It was no mere spurious chase. What's it all about, then? This information is not to be uttered outside of this room. Palekana has... negotiated a backroom deal with our government. <laughs> oh, have they now? And so... What, you can do better than that? Nuclear power is returning. And as for radioactive waste involved, Palikana has offered to dispose of it. What? We've been told Nele Island, their nerve center, possesses the facilities to see it buried. Palikana was able to coordinate this arrangement thanks to one man, Ebina, of the Seriu clan. Ebina? Seriously? Waste is the ultimate quandary for any nuclear society. Reactors can pose more harm than good because of it. Considering that, Ebina and Palikana represented a true godsend. The men at the top couldn't be happier, of course. They could restart the generators, construct new plants, even export them to smaller nations for massive profit. However, the Daidoji faction knows when something is too good to be true. We are certain there's some sort of pitfall lying in wait here. Okay, a, pit a pitfall? What, what do you mean? We're not sure. The only people who would know for certain are the ones who offered the deal. To understand Palikana's true intentions, superficial negotiations will not suffice. We have to dissect them. And the only way to manage that is with the proper bait. So they're just bait to you? Akane-san and Lani? Yes. The Daidoji faction has seen fit to share that with us under the circumstances. Hanawa's death was unusually blindsiding. So give it to us straight. You Daidoji guys. You're like actual evil masterminds. We are a shadow power in Japan. That said, the shadows aren't what they once were. So why come to Hawaii and play proxy war with Palikana? It can't just be as simple as stopping a bad deal. You misunderstand us entirely. Our interests lie solely in the prosperity of Japan. We simply place our focus on long-term planning rather than short-term profit. Palaikana's waste disposal is unlikely as secure as they claim, nor worth what they'd siphon from our taxes. When the future comes, what sort of country will our children inherit? That's the question every patriot must answer honestly. Huh. Spoken like a true man in black. I've got a question. Assuming we get Lonnie back, what would be your next move? Just as before, we would escort her out of Palikana's reach. We still have our aircraft prepared. Okay. In that case, let's say that right now, our goals are the same. Keeping Akane-san and Lonnie from Palikana's hands. Certainly. Only one impediment. The man who betrayed us for the enemy. Yeah. Hey, John. You said before you found out more about him? Eiji Mitamura. Surprisingly, that's actually his real name. Started out as a political reporter for the Toto Post. Hey, John worked at a paper? Indeed. Until his abrupt termination five years ago. After he was found guilty for vehicular assault. Some kind of hit and run? Seemingly. However, Mitamura insisted he was framed by Yakuza in his testimony. He specifically named the Arakawa family, saying they were colluding with the police commissioner. What? Apparently, he'd been on their case for some time, picking up evidence of corruption. Mitamura was good enough at his job to be considered a threat. And so, he had to be silenced. So, after another long, exhausting day on the beat, our reporter was driving home when, suddenly, a pedestrian steps in front of his car. A.G. says it was the Arakawa family setting him up. No real proof, of course. Then the car's EDR footage was examined in court. The victim was moving erratically. Even so, there's still nothing conclusive there. And when the victim denied any connection to Arakawa, it was the final nail. 
Fortunately, with only minor injuries sustained, it was ruled a fairly slight driver's error. He got off with a fine of a few hundred thousand yen. However, his public reputation was another matter. Supposing the Arakawas really were behind the accident. Regardless of the verdict, they got what they were after the moment it happened. You said Eiji had no proof. Why do I feel like you know there's more to it? Even if the Arakawa family planned the incident, Masumi Arakawa's involvement is doubtful at best. No single reporter, however much noise they're making, would draw the Patriarch's attention. That said, Joe Sawashiro is another matter entirely. We would have to admit, this seems quite like his handiwork. Well, if it's really true, then Eiji and I have way more in common than I'd have thought. Mafia, Yakuza, whatever. We both had our lives fucked by these people. <clears throat> All right, so where does Eiji go from there? After being let go from the post, he decided to take up a new cause. A non-profit organization, Leech Japan. Oh, no. Hey, Sean? No way. He threw in with those bastards? The Arakawa family had cost him everything. Yakuza abolitionists like Leech Japan must have seemed quite noble. Hardly difficult to see why he turned to them. <clears throat> Mitamura flourished within their network. Ryo Aoki quickly took notice of him, gave him leadership over the entire Tokyo metropolis. Hmm. Wasn't Kume the head of the Yokohama branch? That's some trick of fate, huh, Kasuga? Yeah. One thing, though. So if Eichan hates Yakuza as much as he seems to, why would he work with Ebina? Does he actually buy into the whole second dissolution story? That's about the only reason that makes sense, given what we're hearing. The guy's so desperate for payback on the Yakuza. He'll help another Yakuza take them down. Hold on. You really think so? Eiji's a true believer in the dissolution. Okay, maybe. But the things he's done? Helping the Mafia kidnap a little girl? I can't imagine crossing those lines for revenge. Well, maybe you're less alike than you think. Eichan will just have to give us answers himself. All right, on. So what's next? Ebino recruits A.G., who takes Chitose's channel over? Uh, once a reporter, always a reporter? Or a gossipy VTuber, in this case. And now, the channel's practically Ebina's mouthpiece. Mitamura is likewise Ebina's proxy in Hawaii. Polycon's support strengthens him considerably. Lani is the key here. Without her, we fail. Kiryu-san's legacy, Anoma's sacrifice, all will amount to nothing. Yeah, no shit, but we're still dead in the water over here. Oh, Shichan sent me a text! Whoa, what'd she say? It's just a picture. Looks like some kind of bar? She just took it. Think Chichan wants us to meet her there? Could that be where Eiji's hold up? Tell me, any chance you know this place? Please say you do. Oh yeah, don't worry, I got this. Shit, yeah! Kasuga-san, do you believe Lonnie's there as well? Better get there fast. Find out. Thanks, guys! Anuma-san, I hope your faith in them proves wise. Ichiban. So, that picture, it's a place called Club Guilty. Only thing is, it's off District 5. That's Barracuda. I knew Barracuda. He was working with the guy from the Barracudas. I assume they be in the Barracuda territory. That's Barracuda territory. Hold on. Then we gotta keep our guard up. Well, right, Kazuga? I hate to say it, but there's a chance that Chitose's trying to screw us over again. Let's make sure we're ready for anything. Ooh. Let's see. So you want me to make sure I'm ready for anything, eh? That means... We're going through the dungeon once. Just once. 
We're gonna do a one-time round. We're gonna probably mess around with classes. All right, let's see what we got. Today's fit. Holy cow! I got a lot of work with these guys to do. Now this is Macho. I mean, he has one more level left, but I'd rather change him. I need a makeover. All right, you're going host. Oh God, that was <laughs> great. Right. This is. I got juicy tastes. What suits me? Hmm? Huh? Get it? It's like a oh, does it come in my size? What matches my personality? Who's <laughs> sexy? Oh yeah, this is cool. Oh god, I got all six. Nice. Yeah, holy cow, I haven't mm, I am immediately campfire cook, which is an amazing move. Hero's blessing. Oh, you can get another. Oh, that's you can bring over a special with that. Mm. What matches my personality? Think I can pull this off? Oh yeah, this is what suits me. I mean, these two are gonna that, stay the same. But I'm gonna stay desperado for now. All right, one second. I need to increase his bond, and then I want you, you, beat shy barbecue, and then do, well, actually, uh, yeah, beach side barbecue's fine, and then I want something, that, do you have a grapple? Aha, uh -huh. okay. All right, we're gonna do this once. Ooh, a fairy, fa oh man. Let me guess, fairy lay is better than a regular lay. God damn it, oh I should've done this a while ago. All right, we're doing this just to top off my characters because it's been a while. This, dun Yo, I think I found something. this dungeon's gonna be easy though. Don't worry. Hey, uh, think we might find something up over there? Maybe. What are you what are you staring at? Get out of my town! Okay, you asked for it. Yeah. <laughs> Looks like I'm up. Hey! Nice. I'm even stronger now. Oh, that just hit me. That just hit me. I'm staying with this class because I want to get my ultimate and bring that over. I'm getting rid of your powering. And I'm replacing it with. Bring in the master, evil god in the choku. It's actually really good. Yeah, look at that. Mm. And I'm gonna get rid of this. You're a fancy car. Where are you? Alright, we're good now. Wait, just to me. Do I have. I do! And then with you, oh yeah, I don't have one. All right. Are hey, you seeing what I'm seeing? I need to sleep. Go down now. All right, we're here to find the five people, do the ten floors, and then we're gonna continue with the story. Yo, I think I found something. Oh, by the way, I was mentioning it uh, uh, probably a while ago, but there are weirdos that hide in chests. They are in here. The chest will emit purple smoke when you open it, and a weirdo will pop out. What you looking at? Run on home to mama. All right, let's go. Run on home to mama. Cool. Open one. All right, goodbye. This ain't moonshine, fella. Everything feels bad. Looks like I'm up. Let's go. 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 Let's go.
Alright guys, you have some catching up to do with Kiryu's gang. Blame my throat sickness, my viral... Uh, my, I have viral infection or something go. back in my throat. Fun time. I still feel it, not as bad as before. What's with you? What's with you? I'll take you down! Come on! Alright, goodbye. Full power! That's how you feel. It just hit me. Oh, it just hit me. Man, I forgot how much tankier Dachi is. He has basically 200 more health than us. Yep, I, I, I did everywhere on the floor. Let's go, go, go. Alright, back to it. That's how you do it. Yeah, let's go, guys. When we, if we ever get Cheech on back, she'll need catch up. That end. So far, it's a straight corridor. Yo, I think I found something. Uh, it better not be a weirdo. Should I open it? Well, damn it. Whoa. Go cry, mama. Okay, you asked for it. Oh man. All right. Got you now. All right, Shaw, so take here. this. Hey, uh -huh. Yeah. Two, uh -huh. <sighs> How was I supposed to know some asshole was gonna pop out? What happens in Hawaii? Japan? Why do enemies love hiding in boxes? Okay, I love that dialogue. Cause yeah, in the last game, they just hid in boxes. Oh yeah. Healing group. Apparently boxes are just where you hide, man. It's just it's great. Hey, uh think we might find some something over there. Oh, yes. Oh. Hey, uh, think we might find something over there. Man, yeah, this one's just a straight corridor, which I have no problem with, especially because I want to do this nice and fast. Yo, uh... You better remember me! Okay, you have Oh, we're going against the Macho Man. You can tell I was supposed to do this dungeon a while back. Hey! I'm even stronger now. Yo, I think I found something! Cool. Rolling out. Damn, that felt good! Yeah! Let's go. I wonder what the EX floors on this one are like, because when you go down 10 floors and then you start the next floor, they change the look a little bit, but I would love it if they did something like Final Fantasy XIV's, like, uh, Palace of Dead does, where each, after every three or four floors, the layout changes completely in the what theme and the music. Can be cool. Maybe in the future. Come on, guys! Oh! Cool! Open one! <laughs> Looks like I'm up. Who do I have it in me? Yeah. Hey! 
you there. Care for some flowers? The battle is on. You guys are bad. Folks, oh, Master Roshi. I shot Master Roshi. Yeah, it's just gonna link up to that. That's useless for me. Hey, uh, think we might find something over there. Might be in a hurry, it doesn't mean I'm not getting out of the collection. Let me out. Yo, I think I found something. Yeah. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Yo, I think I found something. What are you looking? What are you looking? What are you looking at? What are you looking at? Blind monkey strike. All right, let's go. I think this floor is done. All right, back to it. That's how you do it. Hey, you there! This will be a good workout. Come on! Stronger now. Uh -huh. Drinks later. Someone's asking for help. Oh, Barry! You're going down. Yeah. Let's do this, guys. Hell yeah! Here's what true friends are made of. Woo! <laughs> Ready as I'll ever be. In the yeah, I need to increase the dodge each ring. That is something I need to do. So I can actually use my moves with him. Yo, I think I found something! Okay, it just immediately turns that way. So not worth going there. Hey, uh, think we might find something over there? Is there a problem? This will be a good workout. Let's do it! Full power! That's how you do it. All right, let's keep moving. Should I open it? Sweet! Huh. Well, I could probably make that something really good. Boss. <laughs> Seems safe enough here. Maybe we rest for a second. I'm not worried about saving. back and now we continue yeah i can continue from there damn that felt good here classy top hat nice is there a problem is there a problem no not unless you want there to be For, you looking for a beating? You gonna cry? Full power! I'm gonna fight that one guy fast because you never know if he's a new Sujimon. Drinks later. Hey, 
You there! Don't get smart with me. All right, let's go. Full power! Shoot. That's how you do it. Yeah, Look at me go. Too much. I want you to get away the dragon, Adachi. Then you can do double damage on your next turn. We can pop you, get three stacks of attack. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Do that, puppy. Oh boy, you will hurt people. I know. I do it with Namba. Alright, we're good here. Alright, back to it. I'm not going down yet. There's a way I didn't go. There might be a person that needs rescuing, and I want to get them all in one go. I don't want to come back. Hey, uh, I think we might find something over there. Fragments aren't really that useful hey, you for me anymore. What I... I need yeah. gems. Oh, rubber gloves for maid. Man, this way is actually going a while. I knew it. They're in trouble. Don't you mess with us. Okay, you asked for it. Cool. Oh, oh he dodged. I don't like that. Let's go. Come at. Let's go. Oh, come on. Bring it. Nah, I was trying to. Oh, well. The Pandora Boxer. Oh wait, you're weak to water. This was the wrong career path. Beautiful. I might be a natural. You are a natural. Tell me, your and I friendship really have evolved over the game. You started as a cat, a crooked cabbie who pulled a gun on me to rob me, and now look at us. Meanwhile, the Dachi star is a man who wanted to use me to get closer to the Hanoruchi, Hano the police commissioner guy, and we became best buds ah! also. Namba used me to get closer to find out. Gomi Jewel and his brother. All his friends he's ever had all end up using hey, uh, that point. Think we might find something over there. Oh dear, I walked in the wrong room. Come on! Full power! I mean, we're getting money from this, so I can't complain. Even though it's not much, it's money. The Doki Island. I'm coming hey, soon. Actually, he's rank 10, so I can increase my rank with Badachi once I get out of here if I wanted to. At least once, so I can get a rank attack. Yo, I think I found something! Is it gonna be a creep? Should I open it? Got it! Stream clean, steam cleaner. Ooh, okay. I might be able to do something with that. Are you seeing what I'm seeing? Need to slow down now. <sighs> All right, let's keep moving. Damn, that felt good. Oh, 
pit and there will be two more people tomorrow for eight. God, your face pisses me off! Get wrecked! Okay, you asked for it. Cool. Brace yourself! Go this way because I think it's gonna link back up with the other way from the ladder. Yep, there it is. It links up over there, which is nothing, and then. Hey, you see what I'm seeing? Mm hmm. Oh. Good. Back to it. Hate to say it, but there has to be a guy on this floor because I need two more, and I visited all the floors, so can't leave just yet. He's gonna be past that door, probably. And someone's. Okay, you are for it. Cool. Open one. This ain't moonshine, fella. All right. Goodbye. I'm up. Alright, I'm gonna finish looking at this floor in case they stuck multiple. I never, I don't think they can, but this Yo, is a just in case something. search. That links up with that, so that's useless. And that is just enemies, so we're gonna go now. I don't think it's worth fighting them. Alright, so I'm gonna go to floor now. First on the Ready? floor. Oh. Well, this is gonna be one of those corridor ones where there's. Huh. Hmm. Don't you mess with us! Essence of High Noon. Now I could put that on my thing. There he Yo, is. Uh... Alright, we can get out of here okay, once I do this. Me. Okay, you asked for it. I'm curious, what's it look cool. like? Another one in the back. 
Alright, that's every missing person. Now we could beat the dungeon and be on my way. Hey, uh, think we might find something over there? Yo, I think I found something! Are you seeing what I'm seeing? All right, let's keep moving. Should I open it? Sweet. All right, let's see who the last Damn, boss of this floor good. is. finish this. First floor is done. My sensors detect you have ventured quite a way in, Michi. I'm impressed. Currently, I am approximately 30% charged. Sorry, but I'll have to rely on you a bit longer. I'll be cheering you on, Michi. Does not do what I think it does. If so, oh, it's gonna suck. That I've been wearing the other one. Oh yeah, that's exactly what I want. All right, I'm gonna change my class. What matches my personality? I don't know. I could go samurai or linebacker, or just go freelancer. Suji Mancer. We'll do Suji Mancer. I'll finish it up. Whoop it Namba style. Who's sexy? Today's fit. And we'll keep those two the same, but then I'm gonna inherit. Can I? I can. That's awesome. I didn't have two of those. Also, yeah, uh, immediately I need campfire cook. That moves too good. And then let me see. Grapple, knockback. I can also no. We'll do that. Alright, real quick. We gotta go to the bar. I have to increase his rank by one. No, no, no. No. Thank you. 
I need the Anachi's rank to be increased by one so I can use his actual party abilities. I'll do his rest, you know, over time, off screen probably. But I need at least one because I got a feeling we're about to start another dungeon. Uh huh. Let's do this. Let's see what else ails him from the last Damn, game. Dachi san. Already at it, huh? Hey! Now I figured I'd go ahead and have myself a drink. You know, booze here in Hawaii is not half bad. <laughs> Good to know. Glad somebody's enjoying themselves. My man, I never imagined the two of us kicking back and drinking at a resort like this. Yeah, I'll say. <laughs> Better play it cool, unless we want folks to think we're from way out in the sticks. Your shirt kind of says it. You know, you kind of blend in with the locals. Yeah, actually, maybe you blend in a little too well. You think so? I guess we're on the same wavelength. I was just thinking this hairstyle's got a bit of a Hawaiian vibe. <laughs> yeah, I can see it. Maybe I'll get a little makeover myself. After all, what better time to do it? Oh, who would you even go for? Um, hey man, I like you just the way you are now. Your style's not half bad, so no need to go changing it. Oh yeah? <laughs> so, I don't have to work on anything at all. Well, it's kind of comforting when some things never change. And you're my constant, man. Now get a load of this guy. Hey, you know just how to butter me up, don't you? Ah, but still, what went down back in Eugene show feels like ancient history compared to what we're up to now. Getting fired from Hello Work, getting roasted online. Man, we've been through a lot. Uh, you can say that again. Everything we spent time and effort building up just poof. In the blink of an eye. I really am sorry for getting your agency involved, man. No matter how hard I try, I, I don't think I could ever make it up to you. Oh, come on, knock it off. There's nothing you need to apologize for. Anyway, don't worry about the agency. I just wanted to know what it was like, to, you know, being your own boss. Uh, but you had everything all planned out, like uh, with the company values and stuff. It uh, seemed like you knew what you were doing. Did I really? I guess you're right. Yeah? I wanted to put my experience as a detective to good use. After all, there are some things a civ can do that an officer can't. And preventing crimes before they occur is a field that still has plenty of room to grow. I was planning on working this old body of mine to the bone. Be a little more useful to society, you know? You finally hit the ground running, too. Heck, you, you were even ready to take your business to the next level. Right? I mean, my goal was to develop subsidiaries for consultation and security. But that dream's pretty much dead in the water now. Yeah, anyway. No use crying about it. Figure it's better to put one foot in front of the other and keep on moving along. Hey, isn't it too early for you to give up? Everything was going great till we got cancelled. I had no clue you even had a knack for this business stuff. <laughs> well, I'll take that as a compliment. But no matter what, I'll be sticking around. At least until this mess in Hawaii gets cleaned up. I'm real glad you're here, adachi san When you came running with Namba, I just... I was just so grateful. <laughs> yeah, you're pretty much the only one who ever says that kind of stuff about me. But helping you out makes my day-to-day -day a little more meaningful. Hey, you scratch my back, I scratch yours. Oh, yeah? <laughs> And tell you what. What? We're gonna have each other's backs for the long haul. Even if I'm the only one getting help right now. Don't sweat it, because I'll cash in and have you pay me back double. Ha, <laughs> sure you will. Ah, that's the stuff. I ever tell you how much I like Hawaiian booze? Yes, you did. Better not drink too much. This ain't survive, so... You're not just gonna add it to your tab. Nah, I got it covered. The bartender and I are pals now. Isn't that right, barkeep? 
Sure. Enjoy the drinks, Adachi. What the heck? W when did you two get so close? <laughs> <laughs> Didn't you know? Blending in at a bar is an essential skill I perfected back when I was with the Force. You sure are a man of many talents. Must be the years of experience. You gotta teach me some of that. <laughs> All right, how about another round then? On me. I'm feeling generous today. Sweet! Hey, barkeep, hit me with the priciest drink you got. Whoa! <laughs> Easy there, tiger. I'm gonna have to take out a loan, but... I'll pay you back once my next venture takes off, yeah? Yeah, actually, Barkeep, could you just get us another round of what we're having now? Hmm. There we go, that's what I wanted. It is sad. Uh, listen, I know I'm ready to finish your link, man. But we have to go somewhere else. Which I'm curious how his is gonna go. With his, you know, ex girlfriend wife. All right, we're gonna go here. I'm gonna check my Sujimon, see if they're the ones I wanna use for my spells. I'm gonna go Sujimancer because why not? It's a really cool class. Mm hmm. Mm hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Oh god, I think the dark type is the strongest. Oh, it reminds me. Yep, nope, he still has it. Good, good, good. Um, I'm gonna take the fairy lay off me and actually probably put the mouthpiece on me, because I'm gonna be a spellcaster. And I'm gonna replace your mouth guard with the lay. All right. Also, since we're here, I'm gonna trigger this. Oh, hey, pay phone. Don't see these too often in Japan either. Well, most everyone's got a cell phone these days, so there's not much demand anymore. You know, I used to collect telephone cards back in the day, actually. Pop idols on them. All right, that was a thing. You were big on collecting, Adachi san I was, yeah. Until a co worker swiped one of my real this cards. This is it. And that came out well. Oh, damn it, that actually cut you off. Oh, hey, pay phone. Oh. Don't see these too often in Japan either. Well, most everyone's got a cell phone these days, so there's not much demand anymore. You know, I used to collect telephone cards back in the day, actually. Pop idols on them. All right, that was a thing. You were big on collecting, Adachi san? I was, yeah. Until a co worker swiped one of my rare cards. Not a hole punched in the card from when he used it. That was the last straw. That was pretty common back then. That whole debacle punched a hole in my heart, too. Made me stop collecting entirely. Promise me, Kasuga. Promise me you'll never use another man's phone card without consent. Oh, yeah, yeah, sure, sure thing. But well, when am I ever gonna use one now? All right. <laughs> <laughs> oh, poor Dachi. Okay. All right. Right here, Ichiban. Club Guilty. As charged. Supposedly, it's one of the most exorbitant clubs in Hawaii. And seedy as hell. I wonder what's going down. Chichon's calling. Can you hear us? It's me. You okay, Chichon? I was searching for A.G. It was the only way I could think to make amends to you all. You don't owe us amends. We can do this together. Just... Please, listen to me. A.G. is inside. In Club Guilty, all the way in the back. A VIP table. He's drinking, laughing. There's polygona everywhere. Okay, gotcha. But Chichana, are you inside? Yeah. We're on our way. Let's do this as a team. Aichan's ours. We'll get Lonnie back, too. There's no time. And what are you saying? We're not on the same team. I betrayed you. Eiji manipulated you with my help. If you come after me, I might have to kill you, too. 
Will you remember what I said to you back in District 5? <sighs> Chichan, nothing's changed since then. I made the decision to trust you. That was my choice. No regrets. Believe me, everything's gonna be okay. Never doubt this man's heart, girl. Hang in there, Chichan. Tell her I said we're coming. They tell me I'm weaker. <laughs> okay. See you inside. Okay. Saved again because I gotta go do something and I will pick it up in the same episode here. Don't you worry. One side active. Alright, let's go save her. Well, hopefully, we're saving her. I have no idea. Sixty-six. Hey, it's Kasuga! What the hell are you doing here? I think a friend of mine has a table inside. You mind? I'll just squeeze through. <laughs> the balls on this guy! Hey, fellas! Looks like we got ourselves a new punching bag. Hold on, Chichan. Almost there! I'll bury you! Alright, let's go! Alright! <gasps> Get a chance to heal? Ah, okay. We're immediately inside. I can only imagine things are not gonna. Oh, I do get a chance to heal. Excellent. Give me a second. I'm gonna just eat this. It works. Club guilty. Almost feels like that cyberpunk club when you go on the stairs. There's those two guards. Ever. Hey, Kasuga san, come on over. <laughs> now then, 
I'm gonna whoop your ass. I will make you crippled. This should be one hell of a show. Go ahead and enjoy yourself. I'll be right up. Ready? Stance! Okay, so we're the exact levels. This is gonna be a no way Come on! Looks like I'm up. Actually, no. Here I come! Come on! Move your feet! That pick is time! Let's do this, guys! Right on! Here's what true friends are made of! A second kick that gets me it's so slow. <laughs> let's go, let's go. You are going. Let's get it done. I'm gonna put the hurt on you. Break yourself. Myself. Got it. Nice. Hey, so, that's picking time. Let's go. Open one. Oh, baby. Oh, oh, nice. Nice. Feeling good. Oh, yeah. 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 That's so how good. it's done. <laughs> On to the next level. Hey, I'm even strong. Round one's done. Let's do this. <laughs> oh, that's fine work. Kasuga-san, look! Standing ovation. <laughs> Honey's not with you? Where did you take her? Oh, my bad. I'm so sorry, but... Girls already dead. Huh? What'd you say? This is shit! No more fucking around! Oh... If it's any consolation to you boys, we disposed of her ages ago. So, don't blame yourselves, okay? You'd have never made it here in time. Came all this way for nothing. Sucks, doesn't it? But hey, you guys got to party at a trendy club at least. <laughs> Night wasn't a total loss, right? Right? Oh, and uh... Kasuga-san, you'll have to pay for the property damages. Sorry. See. This place has standards, after all. <laughs> huh? Oh, took you long enough. Hi, Chichan. Lani's still alive, isn't she? Chito say. Chichan. I listened in on you saying that Bryce is expecting her. You were so good at spying on people. Never thought it'd be your turn. She looks pretty good with that hairstyle. Where is she? <laughs> Bottom of the sea, probably. You really think I won't shoot you? <clears throat> Your hand's shaking. <laughs> fine, fine, you win. Just calm down for a second. <sighs> One question. How did you know I'd be here right now? I snuck a GPS transmitter into your bag. Planted it at the Daidoji safe house, actually. Can't believe I missed that. Oh, Kasuga-san, you see this? This woman we're dealing with? Treachery just flows in her veins. The girl's a fucking genius at it. See, that's why I used her. Her channel made that clear from the start. I answered your question. Now talk. 
Tell me what I want to know. Where is Lonnie? <laughs> right away. breath would you i don't think we're getting her back i think they're gonna run away Honestly, with her while we're in the battle you'd shoot a man in cold blood you know your parents would be mortified by your behavior don't you regret being such a disappointment to tara fuck you that's garbage her parents would be proud anyone would with a daughter like her Lani owes you her life. Great job, Chi-Chan. Ichiban. Now. Lani's coming with us. You're damn right. Can't bear to see her like that. We'll save her. Let me fight too. I know I have no right to ask, but I'm begging oh, you. Oh no, her weapon! Oh, I unequipped it. <laughs> oh, it's gonna be bad. For sure. Good with you? She's not gonna do much damage. <laughs> like, she'd even listen to me if it wasn't. Let's make this quick. One of our team needs first aid. Now. Yeah. That's right. Let's go! You won't get any first aid. The battle is on! Yep, she has the. Oh, great. Yeah. Oh, that sucks. Care to dance? Be honored! You know what? Okay, but you can't. Mm. Are you normal? Here's the one. Hey, you freak found me. Oh, oh yeah, yes, thank you. Delivery. Okay, let's do this. Been looking forward to this one. Let's go. There's no damage. If only I knew. Let's get it if I couldn't done. change your equipment either. Alright, healing soil. Actually, natural high. Him off at least. That's the last one. Goodbye. Thank you. I'll catch you later. I can do this. Nice. Who do I add it in? Alright. Now am I fighting you, Harry? You gotta run away like a chicken shit. Bloody! Yep, just like what I thought. Uh, 
so persistent. Hey, Jonna. She's just a little girl. <laughs> oh, I'm still a John to you? Don't you understand at all? We were both lying to each other. Everything was an act. I was the poor kid in a chair. And you, you were a Yakuza with a human soul. <laughs> okay. Kasuga-san can have her. He's fought so hard. <laughs> ah, take this too. They come in a set. <laughs> oh, 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 don't squirm like that. These things explode upon impact. <laughs> you better stay still. <laughs> There we go. Dachi's pissed. You can relax now. Lani-chan's all yours. They're gonna roll her down the stairs. Bryce might be mad, but he was only going to kill her anyway. This is more efficient in the long run. Please don't do this! Hey, John! I already told you. That's not my name. <laughs> Souls. It doesn't detonate on impact. <laughs> this is what sets it off. Tear gas! Damn it! Lenny, up here! You're walking towards them. Stop it! How tenacious. Wrong way, though. Chichan! Lonnie! Chichan! Damn it! Hey, Chan! <laughs> Lonnie, where would they take her? Probably Nelly Island, fast as they can. And delivered to Bryce. Nelly Island, huh? The mystery destination. Halekana's holy land. So, there's nothing more we can do? None of you owe me your forgiveness. But for what it's worth, I'm sorry. Everything. I did everything he asked. Eiji had me over a barrel. I knew. That Akane-san and Lani would eventually pay the price for it. Can you tell us what you know, Chichan? Eichan and Ebina. Anything more about them? And the Tatara channel, too. Oh, yeah. And uh, the channel really screwed us all, huh? Huh. <sighs> that VTuber character. I, I mean, the person inside of her. That was Chitose, huh? And you'd say whatever AG told you to. Right. But that only started about three years ago. I had been streaming longer than that. I started out on my own for about four years. But it wasn't a, a call-out channel or, or whatever at first, hmm? Right. When I debuted, all I wanted was to talk about stupid, frivolous stuff. 
I came up with the name. Even drew the character myself. She didn't animate well back then. Just flipped between my crummy still drawings. That's quite a difference from now. And then... Eiji offered the channel funds to commission a big-time artist and increase viewership. She was still the Tatara that I designed, but... She was different, too. Now, she was sexier. More chest shots and all that. <laughs> Tale as old as time. Being retold digitally. I can't imagine that felt too great on your end. Back in the beginning, getting ten viewers meant the world to me. It really was the time of my life. It was... the first time I felt something real. You see, since I was born, Everything was dictated by my parents. My hobbies, my schoolwork, even my best friends, people I trusted for years, turned out to be on my father's take. The housekeepers would spy on me. They'd tell my parents everything I did. How the hell can someone grow up like that? My only reprieve was crawling under the covers at night to hide the glare of my phone. Then I could stream as Hisoka Tatara, and I could finally feel like myself. How dumb is that? Fake name, fake appearance, fake voice. But that's when I felt like the real me. Mm. The Tatara channel was something I started because I needed to escape. And then three years ago, it changed. How'd it happen? Around that time, a Fujinomiya cargo tanker sank. Do you remember? Over 20 crew members on board. And all of them died. Yeah. Yeah, I remember that, I think. Containers were overloaded. I caught some of the press conferences apologizing for it. Well, I totally missed that. The Fujinomiya group's chairman, my father, wanted to cover it up. You're, you're kidding me. Completely by accident. I found the documents where my father ordered the information suppressed. Not only did they toss away human lives, they tried to act like it never even happened. Oh, and that's probably what he, she was being blackmailed on. Is uh, She probably covered that on her channel to expose the light of what happened. And her father was extremely displeased with that. And if he learned it was her, eef. <sighs> I made copies and mailed those documents to every TV station and paper I knew. And then, nobody did a thing. So as ridiculous as it seemed, I brought it up on the Tatara channel. Seriously? What happened then? <laughs> on a channel with an all-time high of 10 viewers? Absolutely nothing. Well, no. There was some response. Fake. Who cares? Shitty vibes tonight. People peeled off one by one, till I was talking to an empty chat. Hard to imagine it going differently, I guess. Everyone swallowed the cover story about an out-of-season typhoon. That was when he found me. When Eiji Mitamura tracked me down. What do you mean? He came to you in person? <laughs> Eiji was a reporter at a paper before that. Yakuza ruined him, though, somehow. Yeah. And then, he found my stream. Tatara, he figured, must be someone close to my family. He also deduced that it was most likely a student. After that, I was the only one who fit the profile. We talked, and Eiji gave me a present. It was a script to read on my stream, written in much more provocative language script so he really was feeding you lines this whole time we called out the fujinomiya's poll among the wealthy elite and the media named every name then that video got picked up everywhere it really had a buzz once it was all over the net mainstream outlets couldn't ignore it people started cutting deals executives who knew they were culpable coughed up more evidence for leniency right now that explains it, those press conferences I remembered seeing. Yeah, the public's outrage kept growing, and soon, my father couldn't avoid the line of fire. He told me to get out of the country until things cooled down. 
Been in Hawaii ever since. It was nice. First. So, in a roundabout way, you ended up freeing yourself from your family. Now I get it. I bet your parents would have never let you dress like this. What, too much skin for you? Actually, it makes for a pretty good disguise. So they don't object. You wouldn't know it by their faces when we video call, though. Because of the tanker scandal, and Eiji guiding the narrative, the Fujinomiya group finally faced consequences. Honestly, I thought of Eiji like a savior back then. He was like some kind of modern-day hero, fighting for justice. Chichon, anyone would have felt that way. So, if all of that happened three years ago, what came next? Eiji and I started operating the Tatara channel jointly. Our entire focus was calling out corrupt public figures. Eiji would unearth scoops and write our scripts. His stories were accurate, well-researched, and most importantly, they were sensational. Politicians, CEOs, celebrities, he exposed anyone in power with something foul hidden in their closet. More and more people started watching our videos, of course. Our subscriber count kept growing. Kept growing so fast it was ridiculous. Uh, that sounds like the Tatara channel we're familiar with now. Believe me. I thought I was doing the right thing. With news media bought and paid for, they never would have gone after the people in charge like we did. And then, little by little, Eiji's scripts started going off the rails. He wrote about an ex-Yakuza who claimed he had reformed, but was still double-dealing in secret. At the time, it seemed like another legitimate expose. Uh, but after that stream went out, more and more scripts came in about former criminals who were trying to make a new start. People who'd already paid their debt to society made a spectacle of. He must have sensed his game plan at that point. Feed you and the viewers real scoops first to amass an audience, then start on his actual objective. Hisoka Tatara became a puppet, dancing on his shitty little strings. And I was being used to ruin the lives of people who didn't deserve it. I never wanted that. Tatara was never supposed to be like this. This vindictive little tattletale. <sighs> It was all too much to take. So I told Eiji that I was leaving. Except, he wouldn't let you quit. That was when he threatened to go public with my real identity. And the name Ebina, his Yakuza benefactor, started getting thrown around. So I shut up and read the next script. The hero of Yokohama, exploiting ex-Yakuza to do his bidding. Now I get it. After that, you won't know the rest. Let me ask one thing. You defied Achan, even though he could ruin you. What made you do that? <sighs> Akane, son. Lani was all alone, and she protected her. She's an old woman, but still willing to risk her life to do good. Once I saw her, I just couldn't live with myself anymore. And see. But I know. I know that doesn't make up for the channel. For all the evil I've done. Eiji frightened me so much. I, I couldn't openly oppose him. Back at Akane san's house. What? Technically, she could make a video uh, if she sells control of the channel. She could do a video explaining some of these things and then point the fingers as ag bryce and all of them she could and i um maybe did what i did to you it was to buy you time hoping you'd find akane san on your own because ag had given me orders pose as the housekeeper he said and when ichiban comes get in with him he was betting you'd find her before anyone else and so chichan you thought that by stealing my clothes and getting me arrested for indecency, you were actually helping me out in the long run. Yeah, I'm not a pro spy or anything. I was desperate. When AG asked what happened, I figure I'd make something up about unexpected trouble. Only, then Kiryu-san showed up and got involved. 
So at District 5, he gave me one last chance to start following you. If I failed again, he would tell my family everything I'd done. What a scheme. In the end, I was too weak and scared to do anything but go along with it. And now Hanawa-san and Wong are dead. Akane-san and Lani are still in danger. I can't make any more excuses. No more lies. And you're not keeping anything else from us, right? Right. I swear to you. Can we believe that? A born traitor will stab you in the back again and again. You're right. I guess. There's nothing left to say. Hey, you all right with this, Kasuga? Tomi has a pretty valid point. Maybe traitors can't be trusted. Of course, Tomi also betrayed Yamai, so that's rich coming from him. I just knew someone would bring that up. I knew. <laughs> Chichan, when we first met, for whatever reason, you took everything I had on me. Except this. <gasps> you knew I wanted to give it to Akane-san, that it was important. We talked about it while we ate, remember? That's why you left it with me, isn't it? <laughs> maybe. Or maybe I just thought I wouldn't be able to pawn it. Could be. Either way, I appreciate it. Because it really is something important. And I never got to say this. Thank you, Chichan. <laughs> this fucking guy. This was supposed to be my apology. Why are you like this? Okay. Thank you, too, Ichiban. Awesome. That takes care of all that. Lonnie's still Hawaii's hottest commodity, and Akane-san can't protect her anymore. As it is, there's nothing in the world that'll keep me from seeing this through. Actually, there is something. It's called a Doki Island and Sujimon. Everyone... I'll need your help, though. Let's make things right for them. Count on me. <laughs> Come on. You even have to ask? Mm-hmm. I'm here to stay. Yeah. Welcome back, Chichan. So then, the Kasuga party is reunited once and for all. <laughs> Damn right! Now! Cheers! Cheers! All right, she's back. Now I can actually change her equipment. God! <laughs> oh, thank God for pound mates. I should have used the new one I got, but it's a little bit expensive, and I didn't think I needed it yet. So, you think Lonnie's been taken to Nelly Island? Yeah. Hmm. That's most likely. That's the most likely place. Of course, nobody seems to know where it is. There's one person we haven't asked yet. Uh, haven't asked Akane-san. You check on her. She's at Yamai's, right? Yeah. Yeah. Let's move. Also, hey, her haircut. It's still there. I actually like her haircut. What a bad fortune. Hey, I think I'm gonna end it here. That would. Oh wait. Yeah, but I think I'm gonna end it here. And then I'm probably going to do stuff. Are there any side quests there or not? Okay. But I'm gonna probably start next episode by doing all of Dachi's links and all those. So I will see you next time. And well.